Hi guys, it's Marcus here and uh, I made this model in SketchUp. Actually, I didn't make the uh, Y-Wing in SketchUp. I found it from the 3D warehouse. I exported it to KeyShot and here's the, I think, the final render of what I'm gonna put into Photoshop. And uh, here it is in Photoshop. So I started, it's uh, actually gonna go a bit faster yeah here so yeah I tried to find a good amount of uh, like darkness and everything and uh, then I just found some textures to overlay on the uh, on the ground could have done that in uh, SketchUp but I decided that it's better to do it in Photoshop anyway uh, then I I guess yeah I put some like wide angle bars and I thought I'd make it look like it's, uh, you know, end of the world kind of stuff. So I put some vines and, uh, like, vegetation coming down from the hole up top. And uh, I think uh, at the end you'll see they turned out pretty well. I thought about making a tree that has grown, you know, through the... Uh, through the wing and the cockpit of the Y-Wing but then I just decided it really didn't <laughs> look good and it would just ruin the whole picture uh, I tried making and I think it turned out really good uh, I, I made some rust onto the uh, onto the ship right here I think the uh, colors came out pretty well at the end as you'll you'll see in a few seconds I haven't really done anything with rust or or anything like that so this was pretty much the first and uh, I didn't have any reference pictures but uh, I know how rust acts <laughs> and uh, you know I thought about it being uh, under this big hole and uh, you know there's there's rain coming down and everything so that pretty much was easy thinking how the uh, water would have flown down and then I <laughs> just made something on the edge that didn't turn out pretty uh, very well but uh, but I think in the final picture you just don't notice the small kind of details uh, then some rust onto the um, the floor of the place. Uh, a little more vegetation. Uh, one thing that I didn't uh, forgot to um, oh yeah, I put some vegetation onto the onto the Y wing also. Tried testing different things. I loaded. Uh, found some brushes from the internet and. It was this was pretty much like a test for for the brushes. Uh, then I thought about making like a guy looking down. That didn't really <laughs> work out. I'm not really good at drawing, you know, figures, so that didn't really work. <laughs> uh, what else? Yeah, I forgot at the end uh, to record, but the final product will have like uh, like dust and uh, dust particles and kind of like volumetric light coming down from the uh, coming down from the hole but uh, yeah I, I think I did some burning and dodging with those tools to get a bit of a bit of you know that highlight and darkness things oh yeah the birds that they didn't really work out there that wasn't really a good place for the birds I thought about it being a nice place for them but that just turned out looking dumb but in the end I thought I would do some birds but they would go on the outside because your eyes look into the um, above the starship and uh, I think it looks much better being up there. Then I just put 
some textures down on the ground that would like uh, seem like there's dust and everything. Oh yeah, then I put some moss, moss coming down and you know hanging off the ship. And here's the final product. I think it turned out really well. Too bad I didn't uh, record the uh, making of the dust and everything, because that that would have uh, that would have been good. <laughs> but yeah, this is the final final picture, and uh, it turned out pretty good. Thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.